Hundreds of striking Kohler workers marched from their union hall to company headquarters Monday. We want a comfortable that we can afford our insurance. We want wages increased. They didn't increase our wages for five years. We took it, but we're not taking it now. Workers walked off the job Sunday after voting to reject the company's offer of a two tier wage system and higher health insurance costs. In a statement on its website, Kohler says it made a fair offer, but it's emotional for veteran employees like Dave Robinson. I love my family, I love my union. He is fighting for the less experienced workers, including his own son. They said they gave the, the tier B people a 20% raise. And 20% of $11, $12 is nothing. It's still not enough. So we're just trying to get a fair contract. I'm fighting for more for my family and for all of Tier B. The first full day of this strike caused a spectacle. This is the view from News Chopper 12 as dozens of cars waited in traffic, many of them honking in a show of support. And as for how long this strike will last? As well, long as it takes. Christmas. Whatever. <laughs> At Kohler headquarters, Tamo Ponton, WISN 12 News. Kohler was founded in 1873. According to its website, there are more than 50 manufacturing locations on six continents and more than 30,000 Kohler associates.